professional services is one of the biggest and fastest growing industries in the world because all other industries are increasingly out-tasking and outsourcing their specialized business problems to professional service providers. And the buyers of services are changing. They're becoming more sophisticated. They're asking more of their service providers. They're asking their service providers to have more service level agreements, more fixed price contracts. So they're pushing more risk onto their service providers. Is you're increasingly productizing your services. You're packaging services just like you might with hardware or software to make them more tangible. Easier to sell, easier to buy, and easier to deliver. We're starting to see across the service industry, we're resuming double-digit double, double, double digit levels of attrition after three or four years of very, very low attrition. So there's a global war for talent. Your sales and clients are asking for more and more and more. They want more for less. <coughs> Bigger, faster, cheaper. At the same time, finance wants you to be more productive. So to be more efficient, to do more margin. We are so surprised that even the smallest service providers have a global workforce. And so it's increasingly global and mobile and virtual. So the days of having hundreds of consultants on site to do a big ERP rollout for, for years at a time are well over. So this whole industry is, is exciting and it's changing and you know only the brain need apply. What worked is global, not horizontal. So if you're, if you're a broad brush, ERP, Oracle, or SAP supplier, you know it's getting tougher and tougher. You're much better going into specialized applications, business segments, and, and uh, vertical industries. Specialization is the name of the game. One of the things that we saw over the last several years is that the true winners, when they went through the recession, tried as much as they could not to do layoffs. So they tried to cut a lot of other things and retain their valuable workforce. And they're in much better shape now that the economy is improving to grow again. 